Hi everyone, thank you for joining me for this brief yoga tutorial. This is a warm up that I like to do in many of my classes, and we'll be doing some variations of this warm up. Cat cow lunges are wonderful for warming up the legs and the hips, and just really getting ready for whether it's a hatha practice or a vinyasa practice or whatever type of yoga you want to do. Just getting the body warmed up. And I'll be offering several variations so that you can mix it up and maybe find what works best for you. You'll want to have two blocks. If you have sensitive knees, you might want a knee pad or a blanket to put under your knees. And we're going to start in a halfway lift. So you might have the blocks near your hands. Just coming up halfway, nice long spine. And you might bend the knees a little, hinge from your hips, and just come into forward fold. Pressing into the balls of the feet a little bit. Notice your hamstrings. On your inhale, come up halfway. Bend your knees and step your right foot back. Lower the back knee down. And you can either use your blocks to frame your front foot, or some people just like to stay on their fingertips. So the first option will be with the back knee down. So you can relax the back toes if you would like. And since the back knee is down and you have some weight on your hands, it's okay if that front knee goes a little bit past the ankle. First part is cow lunge. So draw your heart forward, look forward. This is cow lunge. Exhale, take your hips back for cat lunge. You might let that front foot come up a little bit, toes to the shin, or you can keep the foot lower. Inhale, cow lunge, bringing your hips forward, getting into the hip flexors and quads a little bit. Exhale, cat lunge, sending your hips back. Inhale, cow lunge. Exhale, cat lunge. And then inhale, come back with your front knee just about over your ankle. Tuck your back toes and lift your back knee, coming into a runner's lunge. Our next variation is for cat lunge to have the legs more straight. So keep the back toes tucked, lower your knee down to start. Inhale, cow lunge. Exhale, lift the back knee, drop the back heel, option to lift the front toes. Keep that front knee a little bent as you come into cat lunge. Another option is to keep the front foot flat, some people like to lift it up, so find your variation. Inhale, cow lunge, coming forward. This time the back knee might hover or you might lower it down. Cow lunge as you inhale, cat lunge as you exhale. Inhale, cow lunge. Exhale, cat lunge. Few more. Inhale, cow lunge. Exhale, cat lunge. Find a variation that feels good to you. Let's do one more. Inhale, cow lunge. Exhale, cat lunge. And then lower your back knee down. You might release the toes and you might come into an Anjaneyasana, bringing your arms up. Whatever variation works for you. And then we'll do the other side. So you might just have your hands on the blocks. You can tuck the back toes, lift the back knee, maybe step back into a plank. You could come into a down dog. And walk yourself forward on your mat, halfway lift. Exhale, fold.
Lengthen through your spine. Inhale, halfway lift. Bend your knees. Left leg goes back. Lower the back knee. And we'll do those cat-cow lunges with the knee down to start. Again, you might release the back foot. Inhale, cow lunge. Exhale, cat lunge. Getting into those hamstrings and hips. Inhale, cow lunge. Looking forward. Exhale, cat lunge. Maybe looking to your mat. Again, inhale, cow lunge. Exhale, cat lunge. And then let's do that other variation. Tuck your back toes. Look forward, cow lunge as you inhale. Exhale, straightening the legs, front knee a little bent, maybe lifting the front toes as you drop the back heel or your cat lunge. Inhale, coming forward, cow lunge. Exhale, cat lunge, lengthening, getting that nice stretch. Make sure you don't overdo it. Inhale, cow lunge. Exhale, cat lunge. Let's do a couple more on this side too. Inhale, cow lunge. Back knee might hover or lightly touch. Exhale, cat lunge. One more. Inhale, cow lunge. Exhale, cat lunge. Inhale, come forward into a runner's lunge. Lower the back knee down. You can release the toes. Bring your shoulders more in line with your hips. You might lift your arms up. You might have one hand on the front thigh. Find your variation for your Anjaneyasana. Maybe a little lift of your heart. And then you can bring your hands back to the blocks. Tuck your back toes, lift the back knee, step back into a plank. What might be nice here is maybe a down dog. Hands can be on the blocks or bring them to your mat. You might lower your knees, set your blocks aside, and come into your down dog from here. Notice how your legs feel. Notice your breath. Let me know how you like that warm-up of cat-cow lunges. If you've not already subscribed, make sure you do so. And let me know if there's any other type of yoga video you would like to see. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Thank you, everyone.